snake man here with the enemy in my house. Here we go, we've nuked him. Just wanted to check this out. Now, there was no visible mites on this snake. Check it out. Look at that. Every black dot is a mite. Look at them. That's just the lid. We haven't even got into the cage yet. That's just the lid. And this is a snake. Perfect health. Eating. Uh, everything. Ate today. And look at the mites on it. I mean, that just defies logic. I've never seen anything like it. There's more that are on the bottom here. These are all out of this one cage, by the way. And in there, check out the lid. Right, you see the mites bouncing around. They're dead. They're not sticking to anything. Look over there, the lid. There's more on the lid. That's just on that side. Flip the, flip the lid, there's probably more. There is a snake in there as well. Uh, mate, we are talking. There have to be a... Uh, okay, let's just do a quick count here. I mean, each dot is a mite. Look at that. Each dot is a mite. You start counting them. We're going into the tens, probably over 100 mites in this one little one foot long click clack. That is absolutely insane. Here at Snake Buses, we have a zero tolerance to mites. It's bad they got in, but I have to tell you, we are a biosecurity nightmare. We do live reptile shows daily, and we are the hands-on people. So we let people hold the animals so they can bring their mites straight to us. We fumigate our reptiles at the end of each day. We cop flack for being cruel to animals because we don't have many air vents because we believe fumigation and mite prevention is more important than a little bit of fresh air. Okay, long story short, we've had a breach. We're dealing with it. And why am I showing you this video? Because even the best collections in the world are vulnerable. Being exposed to mice is one thing, because of course they could crawl into the building. However, more importantly, how you deal with them is what matters. Remember, zero tolerance for mites. In this case, our means of treatment is this red thing. Inside that is a dichlorvis strip fatal to mites. The residues are also very good. They tend to keep the mites away for a long time later. Our entire facility will be fumigated with this material to ensure that we have no more mites by now.